Hi, and welcome to your waxing half moon um, oracle crystal reading for today. Um, as always, if you want to partake, start by grounding, really sink into whatever you're sitting or standing on, feel the connection between any part of the body touching the ground, touching the chair, whatever you're on. Allow that nourishing, healing earth energy to support you. And if it feels good, lengthening through the spine, opening up to the heavens above, imagining that divine healing light energy cascading down towards you. It might be sunlight, it might be starlight, it might be moonlight, but imagine it releasing any obstacles to balance and harmony, just sending them deep into the earth, ready to be recycled for the benefit of the planet. And if I could show you all the stones I'm choosing from without dropping everything, I would. But instead, I'm going to ask that you connect with your highest self and trust that you be guided to the right stone for you in this moment. Um, the meanings that I will read out, they're limiting. Connect with it for yourself. Notice what comes up for you. Um, these are some of the associations, but they're more complex than any crystal dictionary. I know I mentioned this in the book and I also know that I give some of the traditional meanings in the book. But as always, just you might have a specific question, you might just be open to guidance around balance and harmony, but ask yourself if you're drawn to A, B or C. So I've chosen A. And B and C. So for A, if you were drawn to that, we have this beautiful unikite and um, it can be a really beautiful healing heart chakra energy and also very much a time of things coming together. So it might be to do with work, it might be to do with relationships, it might be to do with creative projects, whatever. Um, for B, we have amethyst, which can be really beneficial in terms of connecting with your inner wisdom, helping you sleep better, possibly helping you dream better, which might not help sleep so much, but it can help with healing, it can help with understanding. And finally, this rose quartz rock, which can really aid self-compassion, it can really aid that gentleness as well as decisiveness that we often need. So let me know if they resonate and have a delightful week.